All right, guys, four and a half days later, and it is finally done. And before I take these off the printer, I just want to go over my setup. This was printed in Bamboo Labs 90A TPU. Here it is in my external AMS. Um, I did dry this spool in the AMS2 Pro for 18 hours, and then I had it on the external spool of the HUD for about a day and a half, and then I just... For some reason, I had the I had another AMS here that I transported uh, the TPU spool on uh, just so that it would roll more freely. I put some desiccant packets into here, and yeah, I didn't even close this. I just had it kind of open the entire time. So uh, there is a little bit of stringing on here, but we're gonna get that cleaned up with a heat gun. All right, I got the shoes here. Uh, hopefully, this thing just comes off the gold PI sheet. So let's give it a little flex. Somebody did mention that I should put some uh, glue on the gold T PI sheet. I did not. I hope that I can get it off without it scarring any of the underside. Right now it's pretty tough. Slow and steady wins the race here, I guess. Um, some people also suggested to use some IPA. So let's try some alcohol on here and see if that releases it uh, easier. Oh, wow. That worked amazingly well. So if you are using TPU on the gold PI sheet, you can use some IPA, and I just put some underneath the build plate there, and looks like this thing, there we go. The shoe is off of the bed plate. These are PLA supports, so hopefully I can just kind of take this off without breaking anything. Let's see. Okay, not too shabby. All right, a majority of it, I was able to just use my hands. Uh, I'm gonna use some pliers here because there's some pieces stuck in the inner cavity here of the shoe. Uh, all right, shoe number one done. All right, shoe number two done. Uh, there was a little bit of scarring uh, right there. I don't know if you can see it on the camera. Nothing too crazy. Should be able to just clean it up with some. All right, done. So we're just gonna use a heat gun to clean up some of the stringing. Hopefully this fits on my shoe. We're about to test it in a second. All right, so here it is. This is my first time ever printing with TPU. This was Bamboo Labs 98 TPU, and I used PLA for this support, just regular white PLA. Uh, I guess PLA doesn't really adhere to the TPU very well, so that's why the supports kind of just break off very easily. Now the million dollar question is, will this fit my foot? <laughs> Check that out. They fit my feet. They are a little snug. I am a U.S. Men's 9.5, and there is, there are two uh, scaling sizes for the 9.5 Men's. One is smaller, one is a little bit bigger. I opted for the smaller one. I probably should have done the bigger one, honestly, but these printed out amazingly well. They don't feel too bad. Um, actually, they are a little bit tight, but for the most part, they work. I'm going to put some soles in here. I'm going to add some laces here as well. All right, there it is. These are the shoes with the laces. All right, so there we have it, 3D printed shoes. Now, let's talk about the print quality real quick. I'm just doing an observation and there were a lot of 
uh, issues with the print quality. Um, a lot of issues with the overhangs. If you look at the underside of the shoe, um, all these little, uh, I guess, overhangs over here are just sagging. I'm not sure if that's because of the way my, my TPU was in the AMS feeding into the printer, um, or if that's due to a speed settings or it not being in a dryer while printing. Um, I kind of just YOLO'd and printed this off just to see how it would come. Um, you'll see here that this is a pretty bad scarring right there. Uh, if you got, uh, if you guys have printed this, let me know what your thoughts are. If you have printed this yourself, if maybe there's more optimal ways to print this, I'm sure there are. But again, for what this is, for what this is, I think uh, it came out pretty nice. Oh, there's another major one right there. If you can see it on the camera. Um, yeah, I do have the the red gradient color from Bamboo Lab, the TPU 90A. Uh, this is a, I guess, the red and a darker red color. I forgot what they call it. I might give these another go. Maybe my wife, maybe I'll print my wife a pair. Um, yeah, let me know your guys' thoughts. Uh, that's going to do it for this video. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next one.